Hey guys, here we are. We are gonna do a quick unboxing. We did a poll at the end of last year and you guys asked for more unboxings, which totally aligns with some new directions we're going with here in 2023 to include Amazon. So we have some Amazon material and some material that we bought um, as we try to niche down a little bit into some specific categories. You'll see that when we unbox this. So let's get to it. First, because this is Amazon, we need to keep the invoice. So I'm going to open that up, put that aside, um, because this box is going to get us ungated in a category, which you'll see in a second. And I'm supposed to cut away from me, and I'm not, but... You'll learn sooner or later. <laughs> yes, one way or another. So, first of all, we have... Is that Colgate? Toothpaste. Ooh, pull here. <laughs> so, Be careful, if you pull that, it might smell. This is Colgate toothpaste, and this Ooh. is going to help us get ungated in the health and beauty category. Um, so, or, how much is that? That's how much what, is a, what? How many? You got 24 in the box, and then. These are actually bundles of six. They're going to be sold like this in bundles of six. Um, if you guys shop on Amazon in any way, you know that sometimes things get sold by ones or they get sold by twos, threes, sixes. So these were purchased to get sold by bundles okay. of six. Oh, wow. So what we have here when you start in a new category on amazon to get ungated you have to um provide an invoice of your purchase and you have to send in at least 10. so i think this might be 12 depending on how many come well, in a case pack 24 so, divided by six so that's four four so eight nine ten ten okay so there's our ten there's ten the other category that this is going to help us get ungated in is another health and beauty category, OTC, which is called over the counter. Okay. So these, um, we will, we will list these, we will send in the invoice and then we will wait for Amazon to approve us. And then we will send these into Amazon because we are not approved in this category yet. But with this purchase and these items and this invoice, that will get us approved. And then once we're approved, we can sell all kinds of over-the-counter type stuff. Um, so we won't be just limited to pain relievers. We can do, you know, um, cough medicines and things like that. But there are, you know, specific limitations on some brands and things like that. So it, it just all really depends this last item as i was buying it came up at a really good price from this um, wholesaler so this is not something that i you know would typically look to buy but this is a feminine wash and we got it at a really good price and it's a good seller on amazon so we're gonna sell it because notice she's turning red <laughs> I'm not embarrassed to sell it and if people are buying it great so that's our last product just a small order here for items many is we got 10 here too two four 12 12 okay and sometimes you have to buy in minimum quantities so that's probably why I got 12 on that gotcha okay. all right so what we have here is a clothing box so when we bought this it was auction style we did bid on it and um, we did not know exactly what was inside except for they listed off a few name brands and they said it was all new with tags. So let's go wow. through this and see what we got. Yeah, what do we have? So this is a BB Dakota Steve Madden cropped jacket. This is sort of like a faux, it's really soft. So this is an MSRP of $99. Wow. We have, oh, this is a kid's t-shirt, no. That what does that to... say? Peace, dream, love, hope, equality, unity, and brave. This is BCBG Girls. So that's a good brand. We've actually seen them out of a storage unit, haven't we? Um, it's a... I think it was a purse though. It was out yes. of the... Yeah, it's a yeah. designer brand. Yeah. So these are overstock items, most likely. 
again store pull sale price handwriting power to the girls t and b that says nordstrom there you go okay not a bad thing to say <laughs> what's this one this is lee on this a premium lee, select so just uh no, forty dollars. Who would pay forty dollars for just a long sleeve gray T-shirt, though? I'm just saying. <laughs> so you can see already. Shine a light on black excellence. Proud design. Quite a variety. Here's seven. Some leggings. Here we're getting into some pants. This is Raffaella. So these are good name brands. Size eight, slim ankle pant. Another, wow, $59. Size eight. Okay. Here's a pair of, these don't appear to have a tag on them. But what's the name on it? Christian. Siriano. Okay. Hmm. Here's another Raffaella. These are cute. Look at that print. It's a fun print, huh? Here is t-shirt. Indiana. Mm -hmm. State of mind. XXL. Do we have any Hoosiers out there watching? Uncle Bo. Yeah, Uncle Bo. This is a Levi Levi's shirt. Levi's XXL. Some of these will have price tags, on, prices on them. Some won't. It doesn't matter when that we're reselling them on eBay. Typically, there's a cropped shirt. That is Gap. Nice. So, how much did we end up paying for this box? Um, that is a good question. <laughs> champion because we had to pay for this box with what is it called <laughs> I can't multitask um Nautica oh that's Ooh. a nice one yeah that's very nice um shoot I had to go to the bank and do it uh a wire, wire transfer, transfer. <laughs> So Which we, we found out that that cost us an extra 50 bucks. Yes. So I think that the... B Dakota. I have to BB look. Dakota. Hopefully we will find um, the receipt. Mm. So those are some pajamas. We will get back to you on this and like the, the breakdown of the cost of goods. Ooh, a little Reebok. That is a Large. repeat. That is a little dress. Nordstrom tags. Not only the tag, but the brand as well. Oh, that's adorable. A little, like, rainbow hoodie. Yeah, and I don't know if we can get a... Yeah, there we go. You see a little bit of the, the shine and the... I don't see their original tag on this one. A little so. glittery. Yep. Yeah, actually, this might not sell too bad, but you can see with this, like, there's oh, a little... Oh, yeah. You can see a little bit of the pink that's in the white, yep. so... So this is a Levi's Snapdown of a western style we have a bathing suit halter top and what do we have with that that looks interesting That's it kind of looks like somebody turned a blanket into a shirt <laughs> seven for all mankind that is a really good brand look at that price msrp 60 bucks wow here are a pair of shorts, tags. Social standard. More shorts. It does look like these were supposed to be cut. Yep, cut hem denim short. Okay. <laughs> Here's 
the Bermuda shorts. And not that we're wearing shorts now, but people do go on vacation. Hey, every four, every three months the weather changes. That's so. right. And it's it's like they say, it's five o'clock somewhere. Well, it's yep. warm somewhere. Here's a pair of Levi's. Ooh. A pair of Levi's. And look, this has the tags on it, <laughs> and it's already distressed. <laughs> How the kids like them these days. <laughs> This is Lucky Brand. Lucky Brand, okay. So we've seen a lot of names that they had advertised would be in here, but they also, you know, said it could be a complete mix of whatever. So. And it definitely is a complete mix. These three are all kind of the same shirt, different colors, which is kind of nice when you're listing. It's It makes it easy to do a, a quick three listings yeah i think that's the same too yeah basically red. we sell similar from our own posts yep. some of you may know that some of you may not and that's just basically if we have multiples then we go back to i go back to actually when i'm doing drafts if i know i have multiples i set up the first one and then just copy and you know change it for the different color or whatever but if it's something like we sold a Talbot shirt l recently, so uh, posted another one, I go back to the cell and just do a cell similar and yep. then change some of the dynamics, but it's already created. What? It this is uh, Universal Thread. I think that's, I've seen that at Target. I don't know where else they sell that. Hmm. Um, Cat and Jack, I think that is sold at Target also. I think that's a kid's brand. Oh, that says 16 plus. And it says jeggings. Do you know what that means? Yeah. Oh, okay. It's the <laughs> jeans leggings. Yes. Okay, now here we have some things on hangers. These look like See, I've been posting on eBay clothes dresses. lately, so I, I'm learning some of this, these uh, different lingos here. And look, Easter's coming up. You put a little white shirt under there. Okay, maybe not. It might be too cold for Easter, but cute little dresses. What do we have? These look These like our champion kid sweatpants. Little, what is that? Uh, moisture wicking or whatever. Little Carters. There's a little little lobsters three month. Here's another three month set. So definitely, you know, summer wear, but. That is okay. Here's a, a little set also. Tank top. What is T-shirt Reef Life. There is a- Is that Reef or Real? Reef. Real. Oh Freshly yeah. caught. Real life. It's almost the same, just the real means we caught it. The reef means they're still in the in the water. <laughs> what is that? Lab? Joy Lab. All in motion. This is like a workout shirt. A little bit of extra small. Here are court shorts. This is all in motion. Um, I don't know where little this basketball, brand. Huh? is from sixteen dollars hmm. basketball shorts i'm sure if we google it we can figure it out probably yep. pretty easily good fellow pants these might be uh but these are like pajama pants men's pajama yeah. pants well you know you you see people out and about in them though so you just <laughs> never know here is a speedo bathing suit Thank God That's it's not nice. an actual what, <laughs> what I grew up knowing as a Speedo. Right, Speedo brand. Be like, we don't want to see all that. Not the uh, <laughs> 80s Speedo. <laughs> that Look is that. Goodfellow. That, um, it's Goodfellow Target. I don't know. I think it might be. Hmm. Let me see if I can. I can't recognize that label. I don't see another tag on here. Yeah, off the top of my head, so I can't remember. Goodfellow's but... Target, and then we have... Stars above, I think this is a pajama top. Two pieces, looks like we only got one of them. <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess it's just gonna be a pajama top now. 
These are maternity shorts. Let's see a uh, twenty two yep. ninety nine. Isabel maternity. And these are maternity shorts. Let's see what. Wow, this is a pretty deep box here. Yeah, I think seventy pieces is what it was. This is another pair of that uh, universal thread. And it says what vintage stretch. I've been learning that there's a, a lot of stretch jeans out there. Zuni girl, little dress. Got a few dresses coming out here. Those are cute. So that'd be interesting because we don't really do well with kids' clothes or kids' stuff. But since this is. Since it's all new with tags, we'll probably give it a whirl. Yeah. Um, a lot of the kids' stuff that we get out of storage units, we donate to the church. Um, yeah, we'll probably still have to lock this up, though. Unless, I, I don't a, know. I think this is a tube top. And these are the straps. <laughs> Let's see. Put it up to you. <laughs> No, <laughs> it's not my size. Here are a couple more pairs of maternity shorts, which are interesting to me. And then we have, this has definitely been opened, a micro fiber plunge bra. So I don't know about selling a reused bra. I don't, I don't know. know about them throwing that in the bottom of the box either. <laughs> <laughs> DKNY though. These are champion um, sleep shirts, it looks like. This feels thicker than this one. So I wonder if it's a set and there's only one piece in there. Yeah. There's two pieces in there. So we got a little like discovery to do, but. Yeah, we'll have to figure that one this out. This is a hot pink. What? Steve Madden. I don't know. New with tags. So this is how clothing comes when they get it in the store it's usually like this it's not all open like this right. i think every piece is um like bagged not 100 percent sure but i think that's how it comes so are there tags on here no this does not have tags so these are like hot pink bike shorts hmm. with a ruched butt so we're gonna end it on a ruched butt note <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe for more and share.